Hello everyone, this is Michael, one of the owners at Squeeze Marketing, and today what we're going to be doing is walking you through the setup process for Facebook Business Manager and Ads Manager. This is a process that you'll need to go through if you want to work with any marketing agency to run professional social media campaigns, as well as a requirement to run full ads campaigns through the Facebook Ads Manager. Uh, you'll want to do this if you're going to run your own ads campaigns, or you'll want to do this if you're working with any agency to do any of that management or uh, for Facebook campaigns or ads campaigns. Also, the business manager allows you to look at more detailed analytics and more data on your Facebook page, your engagement with your followers, and activity that happens on the page. So we're going to be doing this setup today from the Natural Blonde Bloody Mary Mix Facebook page. This uh, business does not have a business manager or ads manager set up yet. And uh, my mother is one of the owners of Natural Blonde Bloody Mary Mix. And so we're going to be doing this from her Facebook account. Some of the things that you'll need for this setup, you'll need a Facebook account and you'll need to be the admin on the Facebook business page that you'd like to do this for. Also, you'll need your business information, the address, website, phone, and email address associated with the business. To finish the Facebook ads manager setup, you'll also need your preferred payment option for the ad charges associated with your Facebook ads. So as we go over here, to the, uh, to the Facebook page. We're going to have the Facebook page open on one tab, and on the next tab, we're going to go to business.facebook.com. If you haven't set up Business Manager yet, you'll see this page. It'll say Create Account. If you're brought straight to your Business Manager dashboard, wait there, and we'll catch up with you in just a second. So we're going to click the blue Create Account button. We're going to put in the business name. And you want this to be the same name as your Facebook page. All right, business name, your name, email. Now we're going to get into the business information. So we'll fill out the information for this business. And then as we go through here, we'll finish this up with the zip code and then the business phone number and the website. And then this account primarily uses Facebook tools or data to promote its own goods and services or provide services to other businesses. In the case of an agency, that's provide services to other businesses. Um, but for this case, Natural Blonde Bloody Mary Mix has a product on its own. And so we're going to promote its own goods and services. We'll have that selected. Now we're going to click Submit. And let this go through its submission. All right, Natural Blonde Bloody Mary Mix was created. Confirm your email address to receive full access to this account. All right, so you'll go in to that email address and log in and confirm with the email they send you. But as soon as your account is created, that's where you're at here at the Natural Blonde Bloody Mary Mix Business Manager. From here, we'll go up to this blue button, Business Settings. Click that blue button. You see these are the people you can control users with access, partners. This partner section is where you'll see Squeeze Marketing if you're one of our clients. But what we're going to do over here on the Accounts section, we'll go to Add Accounts. We're going to make an ad account, so there aren't any ad accounts yet. We'll click the blue Add button. Create new ad account. We'll name this the same as the business page.
advertising on behalf of Natural Blonde Bloody Mary Mix. Time zone. We'll create the, it will set the correct time zone here. Currency US dollars, good to go. Create ad account. And now we have the ad account. So this number at the top here is the important number for the ad account. This is the account number for uh, for the Natural Blonde Bloody Mary Mix account, and that's the number that we're going to send to Squeeze Marketing so that we can request access. All right, so ad account advertiser, you'll select yourself. You have to select someone as the role and save changes and close. All right, so now we have the Natural Blonde Bloody Mary Mix, and we have the ad account number, and it is owned by this business manager. All right, so going back to the business manager page. So we have the business manager set up and the ad account set up. So we'll refresh this. You see now we have the ad account set up. Now we're going to add the page. So we're going to add a page that we own. And we're going to paste in the page for Natural Blonde. So we'll go over here and get the link for the Natural Blonde Bloody Mary Mix page. And we're going to paste that page right there. Add the page. And that'll send the request. Now, obviously, my mother is the admin to Natural Blonde Bloody Mary, and so that page is added here. All right, so at the end of this, you have your uh, page set up, your business manager set up, and your ad account set up. So if you're working with an agency, you'll want to send that ad account number to the agency so that they can request access, and then you'll be able to grant them access there. So I'm going to go ahead and pause this video. I'll request access to this stuff from our Squeeze marketing accounts, and then I'll go in, and you'll see in just a second here exactly how, uh, how to accept those requests as well. And we're back. So I've gone on to the Squeeze Marketing Business Man Manager, and I've requested access to the Natural Blonde Bloody Mary Mix ad account. All right, so the way you approve that access, you're going to come to your page, go up to the top right, this little down arrow. And what you'll see in the down arrow, once you drop that down, is this business manager. So you have your pages and business manager now. If you don't see that, uh, just like you saw me, I had to refresh the page here um, since creating this. So now you'll see business manager. So you go into the business manager. And right here on the front page, you'll see pending requests. So if you do not see the request for the uh, ad access for your agency here. There's one other place that you'll be able to see it if you don't see it on the dashboard here. If you go up to business settings, and then over here on the left, you'll also see the requests received, sent, and invitations here. So from the main business manager dashboard, I'll go ahead and approve that request. That request. And once approved, Squeeze Marketing will have the access needed in order to set up and manage ad campaigns or whoever else you're working with as an agency. So what we've gone through is taking a uh, Facebook account with access, admin access to a Facebook business page. We've set up Business Manager on Facebook, and we've set up the Facebook Ads Manager. We then approved a request, an agency request for management on that ad account. Thanks for sticking with us through the setup process. If you have any questions, please let me know. You can get in contact with us by going to squeezemarket.com and sending us a form on the website. You can also hit us up on Facebook and Instagram. You see the links right here above my head for our Facebook and our Instagram.
Thanks for watching. Hopefully this is helpful. And if you have any help or you need any help or have any questions about digital marketing for small or mid-sized businesses, get in touch with us over at Squeeze today. Thanks.